This is the high order filters. High order filters can be built by cascading a number of first and second order filters. From the preceding discussion of filters, we can conclude that in the stop band, the gain of the filter changes at the rate of 20 dB per decade for first order filter or for n equal to 1 and at 40 dB per decade for second order filters. This means that as the value of the n or the order of the filter is increased, the actual stop band response of the filter approaches its stop band characteristics, ideal stop band characteristics. As you can see in the diagram, higher the number of the value of the n, more it is close to the ideal characteristics. So, in order to higher order filters, for example, a third order filter or a fourth order filter, we will simply connect the first and second order filters in series or cascade these filters. For example, to obtain a third order filter, we will cascade a first order filter and a second order filter. Similarly, for a fourth order filter, as shown in the second part of this diagram, two second order filters are cascaded. So, there is no limit to cascade these filters, but obviously, when more filters are cascaded, the size will also increase. And also, with the increase in the number of the filters or the cascading filters, the difference between the actual stop band response and the theoretical stop band response increases.